Hi guys, it's Jean, and today I want to show you a cool little demo that Olivia and I have been working on. Uh, it revolves around a new action that we implemented for the dice. Um, up until now, when you created your profiles, you could use one of two actions, either play a lighting pattern on a die or uh, play an audio clip through the phone, right? And the new action that we added is a web request, meaning you can send data to any HTTP address, right? So if here I, for instance, look at one of the rules that I've uh, already set up in my profile uh, and don't pay attention to the look of the app. We haven't done any style pass yet on it. But here in this rule that I set up, um, I told it that when the pixel roll is equal to one, then uh, it should make a web request. I typed in an address, sending data, the value one to this web address. Uh, and then in this case, we're also uh, triggering a pattern on the dice because otherwise, you know, it wouldn't be fun if the die didn't light up. You know, I set up a bunch of other rules also triggering web requests. And if you pay close attention, you notice that the address that I am sending data to is ifttt.com. Ifttt is a web service for automation. Uh, essentially, it lets you create rules, not too dissimilar to the ones we use here. Uh, when, when a certain condition happens, it performs a certain action. And it's great because IFTTT works with a ton of different services. And in fact, that's why I have uh, these weird hexagons over here. These are light panels. They're the kinds that you would put on a wall, you know, and you make a uh, mosaic out of. And then they come with their own application, right? They have a mobile app and they happen, at least this brand, happens to also work with IFTTT. And so basically this means that, you know, here I'm going to show you my screen that, um, you know, in IFTTT, I have set up a bunch of applets. That's what they call rules, uh, such that when a certain role is received, it will, uh, in turn talk to the light. I won't go into the details. It's not particularly interesting, but it's essentially a, uh, programming less way of connecting things. Right. And so if I get back here, grab my pixel and I roll it, the lights turn on. Let me uh, actually crank the shutter down so you can actually see the colors of the lights. There we go. Right. And so not only does it turn them on, it also uh, picks a different pattern based on what I roll. You can see I rolled a 15. It's kind of a crazy. Uh, I roll a different number. Let's see what this is. Five. Uh, it's more of orangey colors, etc. Uh, of course, here because it's going all the way to the internet to the IFTTT service, and there's a little bit of a delay between when I roll and you know when the lights actually change. But for experimentation, I think this is pretty neat, and uh, it's been a lot of fun. So now all I need is uh, to create an entire wall of this, <laughs> uh, and uh, see how that looks. But anyway, in the meantime. I want to thank you for watching and uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.